In this video, I'm gonna show you how to record your screen with OBS. First, you're gonna to wanna to download OBS, and then once that's downloaded, we're gonna open it up, and before we start setting up our scenes, we're gonna to want to make sure our settings are set up properly. So here, you're gonna to wanna to go to settings, and then in the settings, you're gonna to wanna to click on output, and here, we're just gonna make sure everything is recording to the proper place and using the right inputs. So keep it on simple, and then we're gonna go down here to recording path and we're gonna make sure it's set to a file that you'll be able to find. So change the location. And then here, the recording quality, you can change it and I would recommend testing this. Try recording something and then seeing how the quality is. Mine is set to indistinguishable quality large file size because I wanna make sure that I'm getting pristine quality while I'm doing these screen captures. And then down here, you can see the video encoder is still set to NVENC. And then next, you're gonna to wanna to click on audio. I will just make sure all of these settings are set to default, so your desktop audio and your mic audio set to default, because those settings will be changed on your own PC. So if your PC settings are set naturally to specific devices, this will just pull that in automatically. I wouldn't change that. And then in video, your base resolution and your output resolution, I have it set to what my screen size is, so Normally, this will just come automatically set to whatever your monitor you're using, so I wouldn't change that. Mine is set to 60 frames per second because my monitor can do that with its refresh rate, so keep that there. And then in advanced settings, there's nothing really I would change here, so after you make any of those changes in here, go ahead, click apply, and then click OK. Now we're going to set up our scene. So you can see here, I have a few scenes created, so you're going to want to create a scene. I'm just going to label it test. And then in this test, we're gonna to want to add sources. So what do we wanna pull into this scene here? So first, we're gonna to wanna to capture our display. So here you're gonna to wanna to set to game capture or you can just display your whole screen. So I'm gonna click on display capture. I'm gonna create new, full display, click okay. And then capture method automatic and it shows the display that I'm using, which is just my monitor. So I'm gonna go ahead and click okay. You can see, it's capturing my full monitor. Now I'm using a microphone, so I'm gonna to wanna to capture that as well. So I'm gonna click on add, and then I'm gonna to go to audio input capture. And then here I'm gonna do test mic. You can see I already have a few existing, but I'm gonna click okay. And then I'm gonna do the default device. Now this you can either keep by default, but I'm just gonna select the microphone I'm using, just so you can see. And then click okay. And you can see down here the test mic I'm speaking into it and you can see the sound volume here. So this is catching my audio. And then here you have the desktop audio. So if you're doing something on the desktop, but you don't want your audio to be too loud, you can change the settings here, how loud you want this to be. And the same thing with your test mic. You can change down here so it's not going as loud or you can have it full blast. So that is how you set up a scene and the sources you add and so now you just hit start recording it records to that file location that you specified and then you can start navigating your computer and then it'll be recording the entire time so you come back here and you hit stop recording and then it will save it in that file location so that's how you screen record with obs hopefully this was helpful if there's any other things i'm missing please drop them in the comments below thanks for tuning in